This video will show you how to set up farm and field lists to be used with your 8000i yield monitor. We will demonstrate how to edit the information either through FarmWorks View or manually editing the information in Windows Notepad. If you do not have FarmWorks View, please refer to our video on downloading and installing the software. Inside FarmWorks, locate the row of icons in the upper left and click the red icon for New Farm. In the window, enter a description of the farm and click OK. Notice a new farm created to the left with the name you assigned to it. Next, select the green icon for New Field to create a field for this farm. Notice in the window it has already assigned this field under your farm you created earlier. Enter a description and select OK. Repeat the process to create as many fields as needed for your farm. If you have multiple farms, simply click the new farm icon again to create a new farm. You will now have multiple farms. Make sure that any new fields created are assigned to its proper farm. When the farm and fields have been set up, they will need to be exported to the SD card to be used with the 8000i yield monitor. Locate the Right Job Data icon and select it. On the following screen, select SD card from the menu and verify the drive letter of your SD card drive. Select OK. It will then warn you that all data on your card will be erased. Click Yes to continue. It will then write the data to your card. When finished, go to My Computer and open the drive for your SD card. A new folder will be there with the new files containing the farm and fields you set up. If you are not using FarmWorks or want to edit the information manually, navigate to your SD card and open the folder rdsdata.xxx. Start by opening the file name FarmList with Windows Notepad. The file may not be recognized by Windows. If not, right click on the file and select Open and have Windows show a list of programs to open with. Locate and select Notepad and click OK. Inside Notepad you will see a default list of farms. To edit this list, simply change the name to the right of the comma on each line. So Farm 1 becomes Home or any other name you prefer. Select File and Save and close this window. Each of the following files is a field list that corresponds to a farm. Open the first file, Fields01, to edit the field names for Farm1. First you will need to change the farm name to match that which you set up as your first farm. On both the first and last lines, change Farm 1 to the name you created. Next, change each line to the field names you want. Save and close the window. Repeat this process for each of the remaining field files that correspond to one of your farms.
if you have questions about data logging, please.